this is a 2018 Eldis Encore 275 and it's 54,995 it's on a Peugeot cab have a look around the outside first side locker external gas point mains electric and the toilet at that point I'm sure we can see at the back reversing camera around the other side so oh this is that's a satellite TV input and a gas locker it's quite tidy as a van Have a look inside. Downside of this one, it has my daughter in. Uh, I need £55,000. <laughs> you need £55,000. Really like it's very it. spacious, isn't it? You when you come in. Go in the bathroom. That's really spacious, isn't it? I really like it. Okay, look in the bathroom. Nice mirror. It's a good entrance, actually. And you've got this side, side on the, on, as you come in, put your keys. Audi heating. I'm not sure about the plug down there. I suppose you can go things outside, plug things outside. It's a very spacious bathroom area. A separate shower. Wardrobes. Winder for external awning. It's a lot of space here, isn't there? Space hooks, yeah, quite like that. And this is a huge if you entertain, that's a large area. That's a large area for the dogs, isn't it? But I don't have dogs, but you do. You have ours. I'm just thinking for my meetings. Huge kitchen meetings. area, lots of workspace, isn't it? These are really comfortable as well, they're quite high. Electric hob, gas hob, separate grill on this one. Nice, what's this? Is that open? Lots of space there. Huge drawers. Lots of space. And then for your pots and pans underneath. Big fridge, again a big freeze compartment, space above it, the, for the TV aerials up there, lots of cupboard space, oh, how do we open them? Plenty of room. It does feel a bit dark at this end. I know it's got a skylight there. Whether it's the, the colour of the wood, I don't know. You've got the table underneath there as well. I'm dying to know what's underneath there. Oh, oh. I think it's both both your tanks, but it's very heavy. Oh, very comfortable. Cab area on a Peugeot six speed. Then yeah, look like they're comfortable chairs. That's a bit spongy as you walk through, but it's quite nice because it just slopes up. It does look huge, doesn't it? Then at the front, cubby is here. Not so big on the skylight, but big enough, and it's got a windable. Skylight, lights, lights, 
Anything else? Somewhere to put the TV. USB sockets, main sockets. Built in microwave. With a small space above. It's got lots of plugs actually, there's two there, there's two there, there's two over there, one down by the door, the only at the front, that's yeah, a lot of plugs, huh. well it's quite a nice van, yeah very nice, um, no boot, no boot on it, at all. oh you've got this, so I'm guessing, Yeah, so we have got some storage space underneath the seats. <coughs> this is part of the Aldi heating going around. The Aldi heating is like a central heating system. But as we've said on other videos, you do need to bear in mind that that liquid needs to be changed every three or four years. And that's not too cheap, so you need to cost that in or find out about it, ask about it at least. Okay. Nice, nice tidy van. You can even have the daughter if you want. <laughs>